Thanks, oh, dude. That sent a shiver right down the back. It was like a growl. I thought I heard a growl back there. It was creeping me out. Let's get out of here. All right, you stand in front of that mirror. I'll take a photo. Uh, there's also some old cars over here from the 50s. I think 50s, if you want to check those out. I don't know. Check. There's some old bricks. All right, the cars are over this way. Oh, I'm telling you, this place. I don't remember it being this far down here. Alright, so I'm not sure. The cars aren't too far off here, but it's it's pouring so hard. Grant says another day, so we're going to head back out. Like, can you feel like the peaceful tranquility from 40 years ago? Oh, it would have been a very tranquil spot. That's a huge spruce tree there. They planted this here probably back when they built the original cabin. That tree here is a beautiful shot, Gary. I got your photo. Trying to get the camera on and turned on and the hack shack started automatically when I turned this phone on and it said something, a big long sentence. Oh well. It says that all the time. Thanks, oh dude. That sent a shiver right down the back of it was like a growl. I thought I heard a growl back there, it was creeping me out. Let's get out of here. Oh, full body shiver. Come on, boys. There's the old shitter. I turned the camera off and it started to say something again. Three things within 30 seconds of each other. We better do another uh, light cleansing before we leave. It's still going off. I heard it.
Oh my God, that was wet. And I'm telling you guys, I had the other phone in my hand and when I turned the screen on just to come on and it had been left on Hack Shack, it came on and instantly said a big long sentence, no idea what it said. And I didn't even have time to start this thing recording. Then it did that weird growling thing at us. And then we took 10 steps. I went to shut it off because it was so wet. I was going to put the phone in my pocket. It started to say something again. And then as we came across the field here, it said something again. So, I guess we need to decide. Do we want to go in, into the dark down there? I'll drive through with the hack shack on, but I ain't getting out of the truck again. I don't know how good the road is down there. It's four wheel drive, isn't it? Yeah, but that this is hardly a four wheeler way, trail at way some up point. Under the hill there. Should be able to turn around. We'll check it out, maybe, but. Are the spirits going to play chess at the cabin? Here, let's see if we get the hack shacks to sink like we did before. Say something at the same time on a boat? We showed you guys in a previous investigation these things, the numbers were synced. We've only ever seen that once and it was crazy. Like, 100% they were the same numbers going by at the exact same time. They're off by like 25 now. Cold? I'm cold. I'm wet. Alright, well let's head down into this ravine and see what we get. Alright, here we go. Into the dark, scary part. This is no joke. I'm not here to stir anything up. Tell me how you really feel about this. I'm not here looking for it. I'm not here to challenge it. I'm not here for anything other than the fact you dragged me here. So if they have messages for me, fine. I'm along for the ride, but I'm not looking to antagonize anything. Friendly forest spirits here that want to come through the box. They are? I thought, yes, there are. Something about they are. Okay, if there are, what would you like to say to us? Good spirits outnumber the bad. That was a darker, deeper voice.
a message for the people. Where's the proof? It's down in there. It's down. Um, we're starting to go down here and it's down in this valley. How do you know? You never felt it before. Yes, I have. I know exactly where it is. It's down in the bottom of this valley. could be anywhere. But I don't know about getting back out of the bottom of that valley, so maybe we should just stop while we're ahead, right, turn around right here where there's a spot. I think that's a good plan. We'll do a little necrophonic right here. So anywhere out here to my left, and down that trail, another 200 yards, we hit the bottom of a valley, and I know it's very deep, water hole that four wheelers have a hard time getting through so we're going to be smart i've turned the truck around here we almost got stuck turning around and we're going to do one final necrophonic session right here we are right in the heart of that dark area so let's do this i need that phone What's back here in the woods? Spirits? What'd you do? Spirits. Oh. Say my name. Should Grant buy Mouse's cabin? I heard Jack there. Pup. He's in the back. <laughs> Is Mouse here? Does he want to say something about his cabin? Oh, she knew my dad. What was his name? All right, I guess we're gonna get out of here before it rains any harder. The roads can wash out back here. They're just old logging roads, so we're gonna head out now. Do you want to hack shack on the way out and just see if we get any more to analyze? Yeah. All right. It's going to be a lot of analyzing. 
Oh, you might get two videos out of it. They've, they've been active. They've been talking non-stop. Road's getting soft already. Did you just want some company for a little visit? Is that what was going on? What game did we set up at the cabin? My window was... My window was down. It's so dark in here, dude, that my face is being lit up by the phone. And it's like what? One o'clock in the afternoon? Oh, we should sit here and do a session. What game did we set up at the cabin? Did Mouse die because of something out here in the woods? Did something attach to him and make him ill? What's the chance that it's a Bigfoot out here? Can you give me a yes? I got a question. Would Carol or Jack like to convince Grant to continue on my investigation with me? Said something. I thought it said yes. I kind of thought it said yes. Is that good? Did you tell us your message that you had? Or do you have another message? Give a final message for us. Back out into the fields. These roads are so greasy and slippery right now. This is it. This is the only paranormal investigation I'm ever coming here to do, so if you have a message, now's the time. Unless you're going to come back with me at night. No. <laughs> you would come here Who's chicken? You. No way you'd come back here at night. Come back here alone at night. Prove it. Cause I got the stones, it brother. Be the last video you ever make. It'll be a good one. Would it be safe to come back at night? Dude, you wouldn't trust that thing even if it said yes. <laughs> like, I mean. Obviously, if it wasn't... I trust and I'm talking to my spirit team and that only good entities are going to give me messages. Because they're, they're the only ones that are allowed to. 
I'm telling you, I swear something growled at us earlier on that. That's when you were holding it. Yeah, I'm just as protected. I don't doubt that for a second or I wouldn't be out here. Ow. Okay, well we're gonna shut the box off. You wanna say goodbye? Got to end the video on a message. Do you have a message for any of our viewers? That was a female voice.